Hi everybody. I went to church on Sunday. I went to the Presbyterian Church in my local town where I live and uh, the pastor got up and spoke about the uh, prodigal son. Now he preached from the Message Bible and I sat for the whole sermon pretty much with my head in my hands. I was pretty infuriated. I wanted to go up and whack this guy severely with that book. I'm just at a loss for words. I spoke to half a dozen people after the service and asked questions of these people and presented things knowing full well that they were not aware of anything that I was, any subject matter that I was going to bring up. So when I approached this pastor and I asked him the question, what, what, if I was to say the phrase to you, as above, so below, what does that mean? Have you ever heard of that phrase? Does that ring any bells? Does that, uh, are you familiar with that? No, sir. Haven't got a clue what you're talking about. That was his response. So then I had to explain, felt very compelled for the, for the sake of the congregation to explain to this pastor who should know better, in my opinion, and should know exactly what about as above so below means that it's a freemasonry text and that in the message bible the lord's prayer which reads in the king james hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done is changed up to as above so below it is an absolute disgrace now this is a disgrace a reflection of the church today with the pastors willfully ignorant willfully ignorant right this guy listened to what i had to say but I felt like I was, you know, scolding a teenage son. You know, this guy's much older than me. It was a terrible situation, you know. But it had to be said. Things had to be said because these people are ignorant. They are, they, they're not knowing of anything that they should. And they, and they have congregations and they have flocks of people that sit under them each week and listen to their sermons. And they are completely lost, blind willfully ignorant in some cases especially when they don't want to hear what you've got to say but this guy listened to what i had to say so i just you you knowledge is king okay knowledge is king you don't have to go to bible school to learn things just get on the internet and use your wisdom and discernment and understanding and if you haven't got it you better look for it you better acquire some of those um traits and do the research as above, so below in the Message Bible. What a disgrace. Have a look at my homepage uh, for videos on the Message Bible and, and, and the phrase, as above, so below. Thanks for listening.